Well, a trash pie doesn't look so bad, but we're talking moon pie here. A slice of our moon has been taken out by that eclipse, right? Yes, you know, this is going to look nice. That food I'm not sure so sure about, but we are seeing a blood orange moon tonight. Uh, we have a total lunar eclipse, so take a look. Uh, we are getting a close up shot of that moon thanks to Sky 9, and uh, you don't see it as much right there. There we go. This is actually a shot from Griffith Park. We're actually getting a really good view from the observatory. A lot of people are actually out there. This is the big public event for them since uh, COVID. So a lot of people gathering to see this uh, spectacular event. So this is when the sun, the moon and the earth all kind of align and we see the, the moon move through the earth's shadow. And uh, so the, the partial eclipse began at 727. The total eclipse began at 829 and the, the peak of it was 911. You can still catch it until 953 as far as the total eclipse, but then you'll still see the partial part of it until about 11 o'clock in the evening. So a spectacular sight. Uh, you know, we've been showing it to you all night, uh, but you can also step outside and see that beautiful moon in that blood orange color tonight. Uh, there's a look at temperatures. You know, today's also been uh, really about the heat. Uh, yesterday we had 90s, 100s. Uh, today we got into the 90s as well for some of those hotter locations. Uh, things cool down, but still a pretty warm evening for some areas. 75 in Woodland Hills as well as Van Nuys and Lancaster. 73 right now in Burbank along the coastline. We're seeing some upper 50s. We have 60s for parts of Orange County. Garden Grove 64, 63 in Mission Viejo. Cooling down also in the IE. 73 in Moreno Valley. Up in the mountains, we're seeing 50s and 60s. So what is headed our way? Memorial Day, just over two weeks away. And in just over a month, it's going to be Father's Day and the beginning of summer in 37 days. That's when we'll see those sunset times at over 8 o'clock in the evening. But tonight it was at 748 p.m. So Futurecast showing us that area of high pressure that brought us the heat will be breaking down and milder temperatures will be on the way. So we're going to be looking at 70s and 80s uh, for the upcoming work week. Uh, pretty typical of the month of May. We'll also see some clouds, uh, low clouds and fog, especially in the morning time over the next week. High temperatures tomorrow, 80s uh, for a lot of us, 100s though for the low desert. And here's a check of the extended outlook. By Sunday, temperatures start to warm slightly for some of those inland spots, getting back into the upper 80s and even 90s for the IE and the high desert. 70s expected across the mountains. Ross, back to you. Got your phone handy? Of course you do. Scan this right here. Download the CBS LA app. And just like that, you're connected to all the best local news and videos. Now, if only everything were this easy.